What up guys, my name is Fernando for Outside the Box Productions. Welcome to another tutorial. Today I'm gonna quickly show you guys how to install plugins onto Final Cut Pro 7. As you guys can see on my finder, I have a folder and it's filled with Final Cut Pro plugins. So what I'm gonna have you do is open up a new finder window and you can go to file on the top menu and click new finder window or you can simply just click on the shortcut command N. So once you have the two finder windows open, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go into uh, one of the finder windows and then just go on your main hard drive and go under the folder library. We're gonna go to application support and scroll down until you see Final Cut Pro system support folders and we're gonna go into plugins. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna just simply drag the Eureka volume folder to that plugins folder. So. As soon as we drag them, we're going to get this um, pop-up and it's going to say the item, you know, Eureka Volume 4 can't be moved because plugins can't be modified. So all you got to do is just press authenticate and then it's going to ask you for your login password of your computer. So you just type it in, press OK, and there it is. It's under the plugins folder, Eureka Volume 4, and they're all there. So now uh, let's just open up Final Cut Pro so we can see that the plugins are working correctly. Now that we're in Final Cut Pro, what I'm going to do, I'm going to import some media clips so we can just test out the plugins that we just installed. So you can do this multiple ways by either right clicking, import files or folders, wherever you have them at, or you can directly drag them from your finder window. So I'm just going to drag this clip and what I'm doing, I'm going to place this onto my timeline. And now we're going to go under effects palette and we're going to click on video filters and look for the folder that we dragged onto the plugins and it's Eureka volume number four and if we look it seems like pretty much all the plugins are there so we're just going to drag one and just make sure it works drag it onto our clip fisheye good uh, streaker okay and uh, let's see, simple gradient. All right. Well, it looks like all the plugins are working. So, you know, that's that's the way to install plugins. It's pretty easy. So anyways, you know, my name is Fernando and I'm going to be releasing some more tutorials. I have some for Avid, After Effects and Final Cut Pro. Just stay tuned. I'll be posting them up as soon as I'm done recording them. And... Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. All right, guys. Have a good one.